big wins and career feats all feature in this edition of The Week That Was, which kicks off at Bathurst last Wednesday week. George's Plains ex-footy player Doug Hewitt landed his first driving double thanks to Lord Denzel sealing the deal in the last. And the leader is Kyle Shannon, but not for long. Lord Denzel sweeps up on the outside to join and head it. Lord Denzel gets a half, three quarters, comes away from Kyle Shannon, and Lord Denzel beats Kyle Shannon. The young success continued through to Penrith on Thursday, where Will Rickson drove a treble. Art Ice Special, which is trained by Will's father, Peter Rickson, gave Will his third winner of the night. But as they wheel the bend, it's Art Eye Special. Straightens three in front. Good battle, the Miners. Blue Collar Moon runs home into second spot. Kicking again, Jakers to the right. But here's three winners for young Will Rickson. It bolts in, goes home to score. Only half the meeting went ahead at Bankstown last Friday due to poor visibility. But driver Robert Morris made the most of the conditions, driving a double. This is Robert winning with Miss Sangriel. Of as they turn attack and rhythm. Running a good race, star play. It's still Miss Sangriel, the leader. 100 metres to go. She's clear of star play. And she'll be that little bit too classy for them. Miss Sangriel comes down and wins from star play, attack and rhythm. He spent five years away from driving. And now Louth Park Rainsman Damien Smith is back in the winner's circle. Damien drove his second winner this year thanks to Just Milhouse getting the cash at Newcastle last Saturday night. Just Milhouse after Awesome Stride, Awesome Stride, Just Milhouse, Just Milhouse, Awesome Stride, Awesome Stride, Just Milhouse, Just Milhouse, Awesome Stride, Just Milhouse, it's Just Milhouse, Just Milhouse will score. While it may have been the last start for Bling It On, the JD Watts Memorial at Menangle last Saturday night was the first major feature race win for Celestial Arden. Atomic Red and starting to rip home with Celestial Arden down the outside. Coming to the 150, Celestial Arden has bounded up on the outside and taken the lead from Ultimate Art. Went Swisho, got away from them, Celestial Arden, and draws clear for a big win. Beat Ultimate Art, third's tight. The last Tab Carnival of Cups meeting for the season was held at Peak Hill on Sunday, and one of the features was the Crichton Park Drivers Invitational. Casey Hawking won the race on Al Positano, adding to her successful season. But going to the lead, Al Positano in second spot is Dream to Share along the inside, Francisco de Gore, and flashing home, I'm not crazy, but Al Positano too good. It'll defeat. There were some fast times at Goulburn last Monday, and the fastest win on the program was produced by Gotta Go Jazzy Jet, who clocked 155.3. She was driven by Cameron Hart, who's been selected to drive in this year's Rising Stars series. It's got to go Jazzy Jet, a mile in front. She's about 25 metres clear. Running home the outside, Alabama Tyson. Milwaukee Volo running on also. But inside the 50, this mare got to go Jazzy Jet. The Jet's flying. She wins three straight, scores well from in second, Milwaukee Volo. The same 155.3 mile rate was seen at Menangle on Tuesday afternoon when Drop the Hammer set a new Australian trial record over the mile. And coming on is Queen of Clevedon, Smokey Nova runs into fourth and down and trotting again, Agent Maori trying to get mobilised but it's a one act affair. Drop the Hammer is going to win another one in the trotting ranks and Drop the Hammer has beaten runaway success, Queen of Clevedon. Two year old filly Mymel's place broke through for a win at Young on Tuesday night. The daughter of Shuby's place lived up to her favouritism, giving her sire his third winner to date. He might get it as a straight and happy chappy Shannon. That wide Kate Shannon coming into it as well. Get a load of this girl and ideal flash looking for the run on the inside. But his favourite's home, Mymel's place, close for the miners. Leading two year old sire sports rider was the sire of three of the eight winners at Bathurst on Wednesday night. This includes Captain Cosmonaut, which nudged the cash right on the line. Leader is Sounds of Terror. Captain Cosmonaut is rushing home with Jetta Shannon. They're claiming the leader. It's still Sounds of Terror. Jetta Shannon, Captain Cosmonaut, they drive at it. Outstanding finish. Three way go. The captain's got the revs up wide out and he's had a lunge at them. Did he get there? He might have. And that was another edition of the week that was. Thanks for watching.